Good morning and welcome to our daily devotion. So today our devotion is about waiting. <coughs> and I'm waiting for this cold to get rid of. <laughs> but today our devotion goes, Waiting is an inescapable part of life in this world. One of the hardest times to wait is during the night if you're having trouble sleeping. Ooh, that's the truth. As the darkness drags on while you're watching the first rays of sunlight, you can identify with the watchman waiting for the morning. However, no matter how long the night may feel, dawn eventually comes. Since I've created an orderly world, you can count on the rising of the sun. There is much to learn from this pattern, pattern of expectant waiting followed by the dawning of a new day. People who are struggling with long-term problems may feel as if their suffering will go on intermittently, but for my children there is every reason to be hopeful. Even while circumstances remain dark, relief will come. I can change situations and relieve suffering in an instant. Moreover, each of my followers is on a pathway leading to heaven. Just as night sometimes seems terribly long, yet always ends in the dawn, so your journey through this world. No matter how long and hard it seems, it will definitely end in glory. And that is a wonderful promise to look forward to. So our um, devotion comes from these following scriptures. Psalms 135 and 6. I wait for the Lord, my soul waits, and in his word I put my hope. My soul waits for the Lord more than watchmen wait for the morning. More than watchmen wait for the morning. And Psalm seventeen fifteen, As for me, I will see your face in righteousness. I shall be satisfied when I awake in your likeness. And Ephesians three twenty and 21. Now to him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us, to him be the glory in the church by Christ Jesus to all generations forever and ever. And Isaiah 6, D, 19. The sun shall be no more light by day, nor for brightness shall the moon give you light. But the Lord will be your everlasting light, and your God will be your glory. So, while waiting is hard and extremely difficult at times, we need to realize that we have hope in the Lord, and everything works for the good according to His purpose. And sometimes that's hard to remember, but we must be patient and just wait because we know the new day is coming and that new day will be glory with heaven in heaven with our Lord Jesus. Thank you so much for joining us for our daily <coughs> devotion this morning. And I will see you all again tomorrow morning. God bless. Bye-bye.